Speaker Wanam. Thanks, Deputy Speaker. And I rise today to speak on behalf of my electorate and regional and rural Australia because what we're seeing and what we're reading is the predictable way, sadly, that Labor governs. Two weeks ago, in the lead up to the budget, there was a newspaper article, both in the Sydney Morning Herald and in The Age, which headlined tens of billions of regional funds at risk in search for budget cuts. Surprise. Now, what is it that Labor has against regional and rural Australia? What is it that Labor has about investing in regional and rural Australia? What this article and this leaked article in the lead up to the budget, they're preparing the grounds to cut our road funding, to cut our Shame. telecommunications Shame. funding, to cut our Building Better Regions fund, to cut programs about investing in energy saving measures in regional and rural areas, to cut ways that our communities are going to flourish, our communities are going to make sure that they can be strong into the future. And I say this to all those members opposite and to the Treasurer and the Prime Minister. We will be going through your budget line by line and we will be identifying every single cut to regional and rural Australia and we will be pointing it out. We know you're coming after regional and rural Australia and Member we will not Bacon. let it happen.